Hello there, welcome back. I'm it with Driver Guy and we're on Auto Mobilista 2 again in VR using my Oculus Rift S. This time round, we go to Spa and win some of the classics. Oh yeah. A bit is the shit. So here we are in our in the uh, pit lane. I'm in the Lotus. Very nice, very good detail. Manual transmission with clutch. I'm at Spa. Let's come out this way. <laughs> this is my pit limit run. There we go. Now it's early morning practice laps at Spa. Ready for the big race later. There's three different car classes in today's event. get going on our lap of spa oh old car oh hello mini now he's in the same class as me so I should be going the same speed as him now spa is a track that I know but not too well. It's not one of my favourites. And this car, I've never driven it before. I don't know if I need to heal and so when I downshift, so I'm going to do it just in case. Look at that. Detail is fantastic. bit wide. Got the circus delight over there, over the jubbler. Oh god. Nice car to drive. Not super fast. Grips the road quite well though. to ignore my driving, I'm not the best in the world. Oh! Wide again there. This car makes you. It feels right wearing the VR headset because you would have something on in this car on your head, like helmet with goggles, like the old racers. It's time to break a bit earlier for that one. So, we should do alright on this track. I know the layout okay. Getting used to the car. We've already overtook one of the cars from our class a minute. So we should do okay. 
there's three car classes in this race and I know the other two are probably a lot quicker than me so we might not see them after the start unless they try and lap me Enough driving around for fun. Let's get back to the pits. So here we are. All the cars are on the grid. As you can see, it's quite a mixed field. Porsches, Corvettes, Minis, Lotuses, BMWs. Yep, so I'm in a Lotus 23. I'm in 19th place. I have some faster cars behind me and some slower cars in front of me so this should make for an interesting race five laps spa 26 cars on the track but here we go terrible start that bmw is in a faster class than us as you probably just noticed Oh, locking the wheels up. Don't want to... Oh, squashing me. Don't want any drama on this first lap. Because there's some faster cars who are going to get past me. Like him there. So I don't want him to cause no drama. I'm just going to let them pass. But try not to lose any positions against the people in my class. Which is the Minis and the Lotuses. Oh, didn't take that corner very well at all. You know you're in a small car when you're looking up at a Mini. Ooh, them being the are quick. So, there's vintage touring cars, and then classic vintage touring cars. I don't know, there's two different classes anyway of touring cars, classic ones. And that's me and the Lotus and the Mini, and also I think it's the BMW Maybe the Corvette. He didn't know I was there then, pulled right out. Knocked me flying nearly. Lucky I managed to keep control though. Actually we've come out of that looking quite good. Watch out for the Corvette, the wheels smash us to pieces. Can we take stuff on the straight? I'll probably um, have advantage over a few of these guys on the corners. But on the straights. I think I'm only going to compete with the minis on the straights. This game in VR just looks and feels absolutely amazing. Been wanting to buy the game for a while, but I couldn't justify paying the price. It was a. Uh, I didn't want to just buy the base game, you've got to buy some of the DLC. And I was talking like 70, 80 quid for the game with like the main DLCs. Now after playing it, ooh, I probably would have felt that it's worth paying that much if I was able to get it in a sale. £30 for the game and the premium track pack I think it was called. So there is still more DLC to buy which I will be doing because it's bloody great. BMW used to leave us behind a bit, I think. He nearly hit me then, tried to move, and I nearly hit the mini. Huh. 
Well, there's one lap complete anyway. And we've not done very well, but we've not crashed. And again, I'm going wide, trying to keep up with the other cars, but I just can't do it. And to work on my uh, racing line on that corner, I think. Oh, big car back coming up behind us. Let's just move over, let him pass. <laughs> What's he still doing behind us at this point of the race? Well, that's why. It's very slow in these corners. Right on the straights. Push, let him know I'm there. <laughs> Let's try and get in his draft. Oh, look up bump to let him know I'm there. Should at least be able to catch the Lotus in front. Ooh. But if this BMW would just get out of my way. That was a sweet move. Great stuff. And that's coming from my, uh, my race engineer guy. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I know. I know. Come on, let's get some power on this straight. Don't you ram me. Don't you dare. Oh. Wide, but we're okay. See, we do okay on the corners when we're not being pestered by the other cars. Try and do better on this corner. We did better, but Mr. BMW's there trying to push us off from behind. I'll stay here, let you pass. Go on. Right. We've got Lotus as well covered up behind us. Past his first sector. <laughs> See, these cars leave me on the straights, but then they slow me down on the corners. It's a fast car. That's sun. <laughs> if, if I'm 
being a bit quiet. It's um, because I'm concentrating, <laughs> trying to concentrate. But we seem to have left them behind us, which is good. It gives us a bit of breathing space. And I don't think we're going to catch anyone else. But I'm sure at the start I saw quite a few minis go past, so there should be some more oh God, cars in our class. I can't quite see what they are in front. BMWs. Well, I've already proved that I can go past them, so... Lap four. Just doing our fastest lap of the day. Oh, as I'm getting excited about doing our fastest lap, I overcooked the corner. Oh yeah, I don't think I'm going to catch them cars in front. I just need to concentrate now on not letting them cars behind me catch. But I think the BMW will do because he's very quick on this bit. See, there he is. But the other Lotus, same car as me, he's, he's way behind. Oh, oh, I'm going to... It's that BMW's fault. Let's just concentrate. One more lap after this. See, here's the BMW again, trying to slow us down on these corners. <laughs> you wouldn't think this car would be as much fun to drive. Being quite old, you'd think uh, it would be all over the place. But it's actually really good fun to drive when you concentrate. Some beaming down. Don't see a thing. I'm down a second on my fastest lap. That's dreadful. near the start, finish line, we have to start our last lap, in 16th place out of 26 cars, which doesn't sound good, but it's 26 cars for three classes, it's only about nine cars per class, and I'm 10 cars up from the um, last place, so that's quite good. I think I'm actually in, in the uh, lead of my class. I don't want to say for sure and then look like an idiot at the end if I'm not, but... And again... But I always break late for that corner. Because these old cars don't have the brakes like the newer cars. BMW will come flying past us again now on the fast straight. I'm 
but I can still see the other cars in front, so they're not leaving me behind. I'm just not getting near them. Hello, oh, Mr. Fast behind the wheel. And again, now he's just going to slow us down on the corners. Can out break him and then out corner him sometimes. Uh. Great fun. In between my last video and this video, I've played a few races and uh, checked out things. And uh, night driving, that is brilliant in VR. In the rain and the storm weather, they're good in VR. I've not yet found a car that I don't like. Which is a bonus. Not long now. This corner. Big long flat out section. And ready for the small she came to the finish line. I don't know the names of the corners. But yeah, we seem safe enough. No threats from behind. Really feel them bumps. <laughs> Finishing straight, race over. That. Was spa and Lotus racing against various other classic cars, vintage cars. All the detail inside the car. cool down lap we're just driving back around to get into the pits sixteenth place but you see it says class first first in my class out of nine so that was some pretty good going and for my next video the skill level of the AI opponents will be turning harder. And there we have it. That was Spa. The 2020 version of the track. I was in a Lotus. And I finished in 16th place. First in my class and I was also above two cars. From the T1 class, I was in the T2 class, so that is some pretty good going. And now I get to just go for a drive without having to drive. I feel like a passenger. Excellent. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. It's very much appreciated. If you'd like to see more videos like this or some videos not like this, then hit the subscribe button. I'll catch you next time.